Hey guys, today I have a really fun DIY for you. These DIY shorts are perfect for warm weather and this is a really fun DIY to do with a friend, so I did mine with my BFF Kendall. I know there are a few other tutorials like this on YouTube, but I actually got my inspiration from some shorts I'd seen on several clothing websites and fashion blogs and I decided to try it myself. Kendall and I had no idea what we were doing and we just experimented as we went and these shorts turned out so much better than we ever even imagined. So grab an old pair of jeans and let's get started. First you want to find some jeans you don't mind distressing and dyeing. If this is your first time dip dyeing shorts, I suggest you use a pair you're not attached to and don't mind accidentally ruining. Worst case scenario. Kendall and I found some at a local thrift store for $1. Mine are actually from the children's place. Next you'll want to try them on and mark where you want to cut them off. Once you've marked off where you want to cut them, use a pen to exactly outline where you want to cut. You can also use an old pair as a pattern like Kendall did. Since we're going to bleach these shorts, don't worry about the pen marks because they will be long gone. You also might want to use a ruler or in my case a protractor to measure where you are cutting. I decided to cut mine into a dolphin cut. Next we distress. I used scissors and an exacto knife and coarse sandpaper to distress mine, but anything you want to use should really work. I just randomly roughed up different areas on the shorts, and I actually found that the areas that were more roughed up caught the dye a lot better. I also added these two little slits on the front right section to give a very distressed vibe. bleaching. The first round we made a bleach mixture with two parts water to one part bleach. We dipped the jeans into about the bottom of the front zipper and left that bleach overnight. We taped the jeans to the side of the bucket to keep them from sliding into the bleach. The next day we dipped about an inch of the bottom in undiluted bleach for about an hour and this was the result. of the bleach a little and make it more of a gradual ombre, I used an old toothbrush to apply bleach to the area where the line was. We let that sit for about an hour before we wrung out the shorts underwater to get all of the bleach out. Dying time! We used this fuchsia dye because we wanted a purple pink ombre, but you can use any brand and color you'd like. Just prepare the dye as instructed and dye your shorts. for about an hour before we wrung out all of the dye and then threw them into the washing machine and dryer. You could stop here, but I decided to add one more step to my shorts. I added studs. I'll link where I got the studs below in the information bar. I decided to stud one back pocket in sort of a step staircase pattern and the inside of the front pocket. I used a penny to bend back the prongs on the studs to keep them in place. And this is the finished product. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and try it out this summer. Talk to you next time. Bye guys.